we'll be looking at how to draw this figure now this figure has one two three four four circles all right so first let's start by drawing our horizontal baseline The distance here is 51 millimeters, which is the same as 5.1 centimeters. Now let's draw the two circles here. This circle is having a radius of 26 millimeters, while this circle is having a radius of 13 millimeters. Before you draw the circle, you know that this part of the circle will show in our final figure, alright, but then we wouldn't complete it. So this should guide you in drawing the circle, same applies here, you don't draw a complete circle, alright. Now there's a circle here, all right, touching both circles externally. So how do we draw this circle? Because it is external tangency, we will add both radii, all right, stand at this circle, give an arc. Now you add the radii of this circle and this circle to cross the arc, all right. External tangency, you add the radii. For internal, you subtract, all right. So 26 plus 38 should give us 64 millimeters, which is the same as 6.4 centimeters. All right. Thirty eight plus thirteen should give us fifty one millimeters. So now let's draw that circle, radius of thirty eight millimeters. Now to the fourth circle, there is this large circle that is internal with this circle as well as this circle, alright, stretches from here all the way here, alright, so because it's internal tangency, 
the radius is 77 millimeters all right so 77 minus 26 should give us 51 millimeters Seventy-seven minus thirteen should give us sixty-four millimeters, same as six point four centimeters. Now let's draw the circle, that part of the circle that touches these two circles radius 77 millimeters All right, so we are done. Please leave a comment in the section below. Let us know if this video was helpful. Also, click on the like button and subscribe to this channel if you haven't done so already. Thanks for watching.